guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting and going to episodes 9 and 10 of Noble Lady Naughtiness. Let's go ahead and get started with episode 9 in 3, 2, 1, go. Okay. Oh, we're going. Oh, no. Oh. so sweet. my heart right now oh my god On a boat? Yeah, that's what I remember. On a boat. <laughs> What's wrong? Well, it makes sense since you're going to see her.
the castle, I'm guessing. Oh. <laughs> Right? We need to know everything. <laughs> You're like, how long has it been since you've seen your parents? See, you say that, but I feel like your father or your stepdad is going to have some, you know, mm, issues three years ago then and three years ago now. Oh, he still has some pent up rage. Come on now. These two literally almost destroyed the whole place. Not a Charlotte. Mm hmm. <laughs> I mean, you're, you're an animal right now, babe. Oh, he pretty. Titanic moment. Cute. <laughs> That's your stuff that Yes. 
You didn't even wait. You're just blinking both eyes. Right, right. No. Hush. <laughs> no, they're still kind of quote unquote early in the relationship, so. He just wants them to work back at the school. Ah, mm hmm. True, I get that. Oh my god. <laughs> you know who his dad reminds me of? Um, you know Yuki's brother for Fruits Basket? <laughs> you the mom? The oh my god! Hey, at least he's honest, though. Yeah. Mm. <clears throat> Mm. 
I hope not. Just hold on. I mean, she don't really need help. She can take care of herself. That's the big reason on why you wanted him here. <laughs> Charlotte, it's okay. She like that's chump change to me. Aww. And what did they say? I don't know, baby. Oh, honey. No. Of course she does. That's her sister.
Right? I mean, but it's a smart, naughty thing, though. You can sleep here for the night. <laughs> I do too. Oh, lovey dovey. <laughs> Well, you you lovers, right? <laughs> then it's settled. You'll figure it out. But, like, oh my god. Okay, his family, his parents, or <laughs> his uncle, his aunt, aka, we still gonna call him mom and dad. They sweet, seriously, like, oh my god. But, <laughs> auntie, stepmom, oh, she nuts. I mean, cause I get it, like, yeah, she had, like, her trigger word is hearing aunts and be like, hey, yo, uh, 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 no, 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 cause you're practically a part of the family. So you call me mom or mama and such. I mean, you know what, that, that's hilarious, but like, oh, um, the uncle, aka the dad, fine as hell. Don't know who he's voiced by, probably gonna find that out when I'm done watching this. But, oh, he good looking, he's very pretty. He also reminds me of, um, not only Yuki's brother, uh, but also the, uh, the headmaster from A Hot Sky. Uh, pretty here as well uh, because it's silver hair and then the way he looks I'm like mm-hmm one to one let's go oh but the fact is Eric literally was like wink wink like hey told mom and dad that you know you two in a couple yeah yeah that's okay right right <laughs> But of course, he had to like, he was like, shit, I gotta take it. There's nothing else. Because if I don't say, if I say, oh, we're not a couple. It's just that long, long narrative. <laughs> I'm like, okay. You know when your parents give you that like, okay, um, that long lecture and so that would be Alan if he had told them the truth. Being like, oh, we're not really a couple. We're just, you know, we're close, but not like that. I can imagine that long ass lecture. And so it's the one thing that we hate about our parents in a nutshell. Because even though you could be like older, you can be a full fledged adult, you still get lectures from your parents. And it's just like, oh my God. When is it going to end? You know, you could be just having a joke or just watching something with them, and then boom, that turns into a life lesson lecture. And you're just like, I really didn't need that today, but okay, whatever. But go ahead and pause the video, and I will see you guys in one second for episode 10. Alrighty, episode 10 in 3, 2, <coughs> take 2, 3, 2, 1. <laughs> oh my god, to sleep. Right? 
Did they put something? Ha <laughs> ha We got almost kissed that he loved you. Yes! Oh my god! Don't beat around the bush. Tell her how you feel. No. <laughs> Thanks for care.
Yep. They went to sleep. No boom boom tonight. <laughs> you know, you are very scary. <laughs> Oh. Of course you would. <laughs> of course, duh. There she is. Like, I'm not interested. No, thanks. Oh, babe. Oh, baby, don't cry now.
You would probably be saying different when you realize that's your sister. <laughs> yeah! And she wants to protect herself. Oh no. But dang, bruh. Would I look good? Well, she's your sister, baby. You just don't remember. But really, it's mainly due to her hair and the glasses. Mm-hmm.
not just say that. <laughs> Friend? She's right. Think about the kids, Alan, the kids! There's a kid on the ground, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> Still <laughs> yeah.
not only that, but go back to your classes, babe. <laughs> Alan, don't you think that's a bad idea? I mean, that's worse than violence, but I get it, you know. what you gotta do okay now seeing charlotte and natalia like literally interact is just the cutest thing because you know at the end of the day natalia doesn't know that that's her half sister so at least she's got to know in these next two episodes because these are the last two episodes that we'll be into when in the next bit but hopefully like when they do when she doesn't get to see her they have like the cute little warmest embrace and everything but yeah she a little badass like this girl over here kicking ass and taking names like i'm thinking you know especially when you know, when alan's sister was like oh hey she's in trouble at the end of episode nine and then we see the situation i mean not in episode nine episode eight so we see the situation in episode nine and this girl over here being a damn leader and shit doing what she gotta do but oh that's okay that's a bad that's bad bitch energy we we approve that energy i even love the fact that she stood up for charlotte and literally e even though in the end charlotte was like hold up both of y'all and the issue all doing like yeah it's sweet it's cute i fucking love it but hey fighting's a no-no violence is a no-no learn your lessons enemy once again these two are like literally still trying to figure out like what <sighs> excuse me um what their relationship is they've been together since the beginning of episode one so it's been a long journey for these two and we're about to see the end of it in these next two videos that i'm about to watch and stuff so once again i would like to see a uh, a confession between these two but if we don't get it that is okay they can, you know, silently confess to each other and just be like, boom, okay, we're dating now and such. But every single time somebody always asks him, like, yeah, what is Charlotte to you? And, you know, you say, like, oh, a woman that I, you know, who's close, oh, my woman that I love so much or that I trust and da da da, who's very important to me. But you don't say it to her. If you say it to her, it's completely different. But I get it. Either one of them, you know, they're it's like they're comfortable with what they are right now and they're kind of afraid of going and taking that next, next initial step and such because they're kind of really afraid to, you know, really hear someone else's feelings. That's the same thing with anybody about confessing their love to someone and you're just, you're scared because you don't want to get hurt and you possibly don't even want to ruin that friendship with someone, guy, girl, whoever. And sometimes, you know, after that, you can't be the same anymore, you know? And so, I, I get it. I, I freaking get it a lot, but hopefully we'll see in the next two. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to Futures episodes 9 and 10 of Noble Lady Naughtiness. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for the final two episodes. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.